My name's Emma. Uh, I'm an artist. I'm based in Galway at the minute. Um, I studied printmaking and contemporary practice in Limerick School of Art and Design. My kind of concept stems from uh, kind of a, my affinity with the lost country of Yugoslavia. Um, my father is Macedonian and my mum's Irish and so I've got a strong kind of cultural affinity with Yugoslavia and Macedonia. The Yugoslavia separated in 1992. I was really interested in Marion Hirsch's writings on post-memory. It's a theory that uh, memory can be passed on from generation to generation as a result of traumatic cultural event um, such as the war of Yugoslavia. Yeah, so my, uh, I got into video work um, a few years ago and I'm kind of multidisciplinary, kind of, it depends on what I want to depict. Um, so, in relation to the video pieces, some of the shots were taken in Macedonia and some in Ireland, and that kind of ambiguity of kind of the Irish wildland and Macedonian uh, throughout the video pieces, I like that you can't really, you know, decipher what's what. The videos are really, uh, I kind of tend to romanticise the imagery. Uh, a lot of slow motion and uh, especially with the sound piece it's really kind of dreamy and you know um, I want the audience to really be encapsulated by these large projections and kind of get lost in it. Yeah. Definitely um, nostalgia plays a large part of it um, I wanted to bring my own personal experiences into it and this whole kind of project was a kind of exploration of the self and kind of getting to know my own kind of post memory and um, definitely bring in this kind of cultural history. Yeah, it definitely has a huge personal aspect to it, yeah. It kind of depends on what I want to depict or convey to the viewer. Um, I work with a kind of a vast array of mediums from, you know, video installation, sound, etched aluminium plates, photography and um, kind of sculptural installation light pieces. With the, the aluminium, etched aluminium, um, it just kind of became a thing. I've always preferred the raw plates, you know, before printing the process. Just the uh, unpredictable nature of the acid as well on the aluminium plate, it really kind of leaves uh, a lot to the acid like to what the result of the piece will be which is really quite interesting you know I use a lot of kind of botanicals with displayed roots as a kind of a symbol for the uprooted cultural heritage uh, during that time of turmoil in the Yugoslav war there was a lot of people kind of uprooted from their homes and um, that's certainly something that's kind of trickled down through uh, generation to generation for me particularly it's that me trying to get back to kind of my heritage, really. I studied printmaking uh, and contemporary practice. It kind of led me on to more kind of um, yeah, analog film, uh, digital photography, video in particular. You know, it gave me a real kind of vice to portray this kind of dreamy, atmospheric landscape that I. You know, I wanted to get that nostalgia across. For the photos, um, they were, so, some images were taken from Macedonia and that kind of landscape, and it was um, kind of juxtaposed with uh, images uh, from Ireland as well. You know, that kind of double exposure um, of my two kind of backgrounds. I wanted to really bring those together, you know. Yeah, so the, Sculptural um, kind of installation aspect is quite new to me as well. Um, I'm always looking for different kind of mediums to uh, depict what I want uh, in my work. Um, so, uh, for instance, uh, the uprooted tree stump. Um, that was uh, painstakingly dug out of the ground 
uh, by hand to kind of convey the the um, uprooted cultural heritage of the people um, and my affinity with that really. I was here um, a few months ago um, for the member show and um, got to see that and it's always a pleasure coming back here to see you know people working with Artlink yeah they're always really accommodating it's a gorgeous space. The surrounding landscape really kind of I you know it's very similar to my kind of um, work and it's just it's really gorgeous coming up here I really enjoy it.